Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you all my makeup palettes from Ulta, Sephora, and then online at their official stores. Okay, so first I'm going to start out off with um, Kat Von D. So I have her 10 year anniversary. Um, I don't know what the palette's called. Just 10 year anniversary eyeshadow palette. Yeah, so. And it looks like this. It's really pretty. It's gold. And all the colors are there. Sorry, I'm, I'm filming on my phone because my camera's not working. So the colors are Abel, Amelis, Ashley, Agena, Egypt, Layla, Leather, Sylvia. Kelly, Sarah, Caroline, Chad, Melanie, Andrea, Nancy, and Kathleen. And those are all the colors for that one. And it comes in a golden package as I just showed you. And then the next palette I have by Kat Von D is this Saint and Sinner eyeshadow palette. Which is, this is one of my older ones, but it's still in good shape. This is such a pretty palette. Um, the colors are just to die for, and the colors are Calabelle, Rosary, Bastism, Crucifix, Heaven, Sanctuary, Chan Chalice, Scared Heart, Amen, Worship, Immaculate, and Abs. I don't know the words because they're kind of like hard, but Devil, Revolution. We like exorcism. They're really pretty colors though. And then there's two mirrors on the side. But the Jade and Sinners palette. It's really pretty. It's a good palette. And I don't know how much this goes for, but it was I don't think it was that expensive. Okay. So the next thing I'm gonna do is Anastasia Beverly Hills. So I'm just gonna do the highlighters first. This one's kinda broken, but I have the Moon Child highlighter kit. It's kind of broken, so I have that. And I got this recently, Aurora from Anastasia. And this one's definitely broken. <laughs> it broke everywhere. But that's my highlighter palette. And the shades are to die for. And then I have my contour kit, cream contour. And I got mine color fair. And then I have this Subculture by Anastasia. Yeah, those are the colors. Really pretty colors. Modern Renaissance. This one's falling apart, I'm pretty sure. Or, I don't know. This one. Um, Modern Renaissance. Just a bunch of, like, like girly colors, I guess. And then it comes in this package. For the other one, too. I just don't have the packages for that one. And these are just some other makeup brands I have. I got a Lorac Pro Contour Kit. NYX Ultimate Eyeshadow Palette, which is a bunch of rainbow colors. It's really pretty. And this comes in the USP04 Brights. This is the Brights Palette. And then I got me Take Me Back to Brazil. And there's a bunch of bright colors in this one as well. This one's a really good palette. I advise you to get it if you like doing like brighter makeups as well. Almost fell. As well with the NYX palettes. Okay, I'm going to do Huda Beauty next because I only have two products from this brand. So I got the Huda Beauty Rose Gold palette remastered. So this is the redo of this one. This one's really pretty. I recently just got this and it comes with a really pretty packaging. And then the colors are just so much better than the original. They're more creamier. And they're just really pretty. Moon dust. So pretty. I don't know if you can see that, but the colors are more pastier and better actually. And love this. This is the newer one. And I'll show you the older one I have of this palette. So, I have the Huda Beauty 
Textures Rose Gold Edition. This is the one that was older than that one. This one's really used out because I used this a lot. This is that and same colors as that one, so these are more pastier. And I'm going to do pure next because I have two things in that. I have the My Little Pony, the movie edition of the pure. And I'll show you the colors. These are really bright colors. They're kind of, they're pigmented, but they're not as pigmented as they could be. So, they're so good though. And then I got the Trolls edition of Pure 2 movie, the movie. And this one's kind of older because I got this a long time ago. But there's the colors of the Trolls. And then there's a mirror at top as well as the other one too. And then my last products I have is for Urban Decay. So I got this for Christmas this year. And the colors are Blow, Nudie, Commando, Tempted, Bethel, Insect, Blackjack, Magnet, Lockout, Faith, and Extra Bitter and pre -tip. So this palette is really pretty. It's a bunch of nude colors, which are very pretty colors though. Really pretty, like a bunch of colors. You can do really pretty makeup with this one. I haven't used it yet since, I don't know why I haven't used it yet because I don't really do my makeup as much as I usually do, but I have that palette and this is not shutting out. And then I have this Shadow Box by Urban Decay. This is a really pretty palette and the colors are Sin, Indigo, Bordello, Tornado, Smog, Blackout, Moon Shadow, Naked Cowboy, Free Love, Lo Lost mushroom and flash and the packaging is like this and then you flip it up and there's all the colors and they're really pretty colors and the packaging is really well nicely packed I guess it's really nice and they're very pigmented this is probably one of my favorite pal palettes this is the Urban Decay Electric Press pigmented palette um, the colors are Gozo, Soburn, Savage, Fringe, Freak, Thrash, Urban, Jilted, Charos, Gonzo, and Revolt. This is such a really pretty palette and the packaging is really pretty and I don't know why I have dust all over it, but <laughs> packaging is amazing. But... Those are the colors, and they're very pretty colors. And the packaging, good. I advise you to get this palette. It was, I think it was like, I don't know, 60 But it's really worth what you pay for it, to be honest. And it's such a good, pretty, like if you like bright colors, that's a really good palette. Uh, I'll show it after the video, because. Then I have this Urban Decay Heat Naked Palette. It is a very pretty palette and the packaging is very pretty too. And as I was saying, sorry to redo the video, my mom called me. And this is the Heat palette by Urban Decay. This is a really there's a bunch of colors and I can read them. I'll read them for you. So there is Amber, Ashes, Endigo, Enfigo, I don't know. Cayenne. Scorch, Dirty Talk, Heat, Devil, Lumbre, Low Blow, Sauce, Chancher, and oh. And it comes with brushes. I just don't have the brush right now because they're in my brush container. But the packaging is amazing and this is a really nice palette. And my last palette for you guys today is the first palette of Urban Decay which I have forever and those are the colors I'll read them to you so it's Virgin Sin Naked skirt, sk, Sidecar Buck Half Baked Smog Black Horse Toasted Hustle and Creep and Gentle 
and this is a good palette too but that's one of the first palettes I have so yeah thank you guys for watching my video please like subscribe and comment the next video you, go you guys would like to see from me love you guys see you next time